Well, I'm hanging on, I don't matter who else. So, tough match today, playing Cheltenham. Sitting seventh in the league, last playoff spot. And they've only conceded 24 goals all season. We've conceded 48. These are in the league, by the way. So they've scored 48, and we've scored 40. So it's going to be a tough game. You know, they've got a good, strong defence. They've got Alfie May up top scoring goals. So, yeah, it's not going to be easy at all. So I'd say the last game, Crawley, wasn't really good. First half, second half, a lot better. We've got Russ Wilcox in charge for the next two games. And, yeah, it's going to be tough. Real tough today. I'm still in London at the moment. It's 10 past 11. Okay, so I've made it back from London. It's half past two, so I'll get to the game, which is good. But I've just seen the team sheet well, a while back, and Butler's playing again. Now, so many mistakes happen when he's been playing. I just hope today that he has a good game, and, you know, rectifies previous past games that's gone on. You know, I know people rate him still, but there's a lot more people don't, and I know he needs to be in there because of injuries and things like that, but I just want him to have a good game, you know. And I can see Alfie May up top for them, for Cheltenham, possibly putting rings around him. You know, I think that's just the way he's going to go. So, you already feel, when you see the team sheet, you already feel when you see Butler's name that it's a defeat. You know, we've not won a game with him in the league in the starting 11. I don't want others to think about that. Am I being too negative? You know, let me know. But that's just the way I feel. And I know other people feel like that as well. So, fingers crossed that we can get some kind of game. It'll be, it's going to be a tough game, a real tough game. Okay, so I've just got in the ground. And we've got score predictions coming up, as always. I'm not giving one, because I always get it wrong. But these guys, I think one of them nailed it last time. We'll see. Hopefully 3-1 to Scunthorpe. 3-1 to Scunthorpe? Oh, I hope so as well. I hope uh, it's 2-0. To Scunthorpe? 2-1. Uh, 2-1. I think you went 2-1 last time. I think you got it right, I think. Yeah, yeah I, I, did, did. I did. I did. Yeah, so there we go. So, varying score predictions. Um, Cheltenham really good, very good defensively as well, so we'll see what happens. Okay, so first things first, man kicked off and we've changed ends. So we're now um, shooting towards the Britcon, I think that's to do with the sun, it's quite low down. Chance there for Cheltenham, two minutes in the corner, bit of a scramble with the box. Oh, an effort there by Gilead, just hit the top of the crossbar. Killed an effort from outside the box, but um, it's a good, really good play by Scrum Club on the edge of the box. He managed to play really well, actually. Quite surprised. It's a lot better than Crawley away. So much better playing four at the back. And yeah, it's a good game. Yes! Get him! Get him! Great work by McAtee there, chasing the ball now. Great work. Get in there. He's had a really good game, McAtee, so far. Chasing the ball down, tackling. And that ball then, brilliant. Get in! 1 0 Scuddy! Big off. Cheltenham have got their free kick. They're going to put the ball in the box. Um, fair play to Cheltenham fans as well. I'll stop singing. Even though all my goal's gone in. One of our group of about 20, 30 of them. They're chanting non stop throughout the game, in fairness. Out. Get it out. Oh, go on. Tackle. Still not clear. We're playing. We are playing well. Yeah, it's um, early doors and there's still time for things to change. But, um, yeah, happy with it so far. 20 minutes left of this half. No complaints. Everyone's playing well, even Butler at the back. I have to take my words back from the beginning of this uh, vlog. So another thing I'm noticing as well from the first not being here is um, noise from the sideline, shouting to players, letting them know what to do. Which is really good, good to hear and see. Cheltenham play it really, really nice. Little passes, triangles. Um, you can see where they're up there. Cheltenham in again here. Oh, oh. 
I think it's all his arms, thank goodness. But um, yeah, it's definitely a good team to watch. It's a good game to watch this. Ooh. Alfie made there and Mucky's it outside the post. Good run by him. Don't foul him, do not foul him. What a ball. Well played Levi Sutton, well played. A goal for Galvan. It's a lot better than we've been used to of late. Um, actually playing, looks like they're playing as a team as well. And the defence is looking good. I don't know what last time I said that. Probably cursed us now. But yeah, I think if we can just keep doing what we're doing, what we've done for the first half, I think we should um, get some out this game. Good luck to Debbie as well, my wife and Mel, friend. They're out in New York doing Fashion Week. They've got a show this afternoon. A billboard in Times Square, so it's quite exciting for them. And for me as well, but you know, I'm a football. She's more exciting than winning 1 0. It's a bit like the first half, they're both teams playing well. We've not had any, um, you know, mishaps or anything. There's been no mistakes. But yeah, it's a good game. I've enjoyed it for a change. Yeah, half of me, there was special effort. Um, you know, about four kick-ups, just hit it on the spin and from where I'm sat, I thought it was going to go in, but there's not enough power on it. Thank goodness, but if that had gone in, it would have been a worldie. Um, but yeah, Cheltenham just starting to get an edge on this game. They're, you know, pushing higher up the pitch, we're dropping a little bit deeper, and um, yeah, they're, they're looking good, Cheltenham. I don't know, it's always going for it, we're playing really well. You know, we've got a good shape about it. Oh yeah, it's really good, players are playing really well, I've got no faults with anyone. Snap shot there by Kev, just wide of the ball. Shetland fans are having fun. If McAtee is in the man of the match from this, then oh, I don't know sake. who's going to get it, because it's been fantastic, chasing balls down, on the ball. Um, no, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, they're in. Oh. Wow. Yeah, it's a bit, a bit like, like today's little battle. Clear the ball when you get the um, chance. Yeah, it went across face goal there. Uh, and luckily, Shelman player couldn't touch it. But that's close. That was a great header by Butler. And he's just come powering in from about 30 yards. He's got his head on it. Immense power. And the keeper's pull off a saving fence. It was straight at him. But yeah, Butler's been playing really well at the back. He's getting his head on things. It's like the old Butler he used to see. You know? And could this be his first win in the league in the starting 11? Wow! A bit of a quality in defence then. Ball pinging everywhere. Um, look at all jumped on it. Five minutes left. Hanging on, as usual. Well, I'm hanging on, I don't matter well. Oh! Nice chest by Kev there in turn. He's just put it wide at both of his toe ends. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh, what a tackle that was. Great tackle. Got out for a corner. He's just about to strike it as well. Brilliant tackle. Off he may. What a twat. You've been bribed! Himself to four all the time. How much have they paid you, Ref? This comes to a goal now. I'll be absolutely distraught. That's a disgrace. That's an absolute disgrace. Did they score you don't, have much, you don't play that many strengths, he's got to use his abilities and his ability has been close to the floor already and just dropping down to it. So, you just know he'll score. Face goal, and I do not know. I thought it was going in. <laughs> Genuinely did. She's so keep our heads here. No! Oh. Yeah. Oh. What a save by Lawler. Oh. 
Beautiful. Come off in May as well. Get in there. Yeah, match sponsors Nelson Claus, match, and also the Iron match, definitely. Yeah, match, definitely. But they've all played well, they really have. Even one. I've got to say it, he's played well. Take it all back from the beginning. Fair play to Wilcox, Turnbull, Pressman and the rest of the team that have, you know, picked the squad. So, you know, I've said at the beginning about Wilcox, I still don't think he's the right choice, but today we've played really well, we've had a good shape, all the players have looked up for it, so, you know, he's not doing himself a bad job because he said he wants the job. So, you know, they're playing really well. Come on, get that whistle blown, referee. I'm no, still not blowing it. Get in! Come on! We so needed that. So needed it. We played really well. Can't fault anyone at all. Well played. Okay, so it's the morning after, the day before, and what a result. 1 0 Scunthorpe. Can't fault anybody at all. If you can fault someone, then tell me who, because I couldn't fault anyone. Everyone played together, played as a team, which was nice to see. Hopefully, we get the same sort of result at Cambridge. Unfortunately, I won't be there. I'll be down in London working, enjoying my birthday. Um, but yeah, but thanks for getting involved, everyone that gets involved. Thanks for watching. And if it's your first time, you know, give a comment, give a like, subscribe. And I will see you all at Swindon Away.